What would happen if a solar storm hit Earth in 2024? This chilling question sets the scene for our exploration of an unseen threat, a celestial phenomenon that could alter our lives dramatically. Solar storms. They're not something we talk about over dinner or while sipping coffee with friends, yet these storms, born in the heart of our sun, have the potential to cause havoc on a scale we can scarcely imagine. Picture this. Our modern world, reliant on technology, suddenly thrown into chaos by forces beyond our control. It sounds like the plot of a science fiction movie, right? But this isn't fiction, this is the sobering reality of what solar storms can do. We're all familiar with storms on Earth, thunderstorms, blizzards, hurricanes, but a storm from the sun, that's an entirely different beast. So, let's dive into the world of solar storms, shall we? The sun, while being our primary source of light and heat, is also a massive nuclear reactor. Imagine the sun as a colossal swirling ball of gas, constantly in motion. In this ceaseless dance the sun's magnetic fields twist and tangle, and sometimes, they snap. This process is known as a solar flare, a sudden, dramatic release of energy that can be thousands of times more powerful than all the nuclear weapons on Earth combined. But it doesn't stop there. Sometimes these solar flares are accompanied by coronal mass ejections, or CMEs. Picture a billion-ton cloud of magnetized particles, hurtling through space at a speed of several million miles per hour. These CMEs are the sun's way of flinging its magnetic energy out into the solar system and yes, they can reach Earth. So if the sun is capable of such massive energy eruptions, what happens when they reach Earth? It's 2024 and a major solar storm hits Earth. What's the worst that could happen? Solar storms or coronal mass ejections are massive eruptions of solar plasma and magnetic fields from the sun's corona. When these storms reach Earth, they can create a spectacle of beauty and a potential for chaos. The beauty lies in the vibrant dancing lights of the auroras, visible near the poles. These celestial light shows are a direct result of solar storms, as charged particles from the sun interact with Earth's magnetic field. But as captivating as the auroras are, they are a mere sideshow to the potentially catastrophic effects of a solar storm. Imagine the world plunged into darkness as power grids fail. This isn't science fiction, it's a real possibility if a significant solar storm were to hit Earth. Power grid failures could last from hours to weeks or even months, disrupting every aspect of our daily lives. Satellites, our eyes and ears in space could also be severely affected. This could lead to disruptions in GPS navigation, satellite TV and internet services. Even airplane flights could be affected as pilots rely on GPS for navigation, especially during long-haul flights over oceans. Now let's travel back in time to 1859. A solar storm now known as the Carrington Event hit Earth. Telegraph systems across Europe and North America failed, and auroras were reportedly seen as far south as the Caribbean. If a storm of that magnitude were to hit today, the consequences could be far more severe, given our reliance on electricity and satellite technology. So, a solar storm hitting Earth in 2024? It could lead to beautiful sky displays, yes, but also to widespread power outages, satellite disruptions and potentially a world in chaos. That's quite a lot of chaos from a storm millions of miles away, isn't it? Knowing the potential havoc a solar storm could wreak, how are we preparing for such an event? Well let's dive right into it. Preparing for a solar storm is no small feat, but it is a challenge that scientists and governments worldwide are rising to meet. The first step? Monitoring. Right now we've got a fleet of spacecraft and ground-based observatories that keep a watchful eye on the sun 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. These technological marvels provide us with real-time data about solar activity, including the formation of sunspots, solar flares, and coronal mass ejections. This constant vigil allows us to predict when a solar storm might occur and gives us a chance to brace ourselves for the impact. But what does bracing ourselves look like? Well, it involves a lot of strategic planning and precautionary measures. Power grids, for instance, are especially vulnerable to solar storms. To safeguard them, operators can reduce the load on the grid or even temporarily shut down sections of it when a storm is imminent. Our satellites, too, need to be protected. These invaluable tools that provide us with everything from weather forecasts to GPS navigation can be put into safe mode to limit the damage from a solar storm. They can also be moved to a higher, safer orbit if there's enough warning time. Governments are also investing in infrastructure that can withstand the effects of a solar storm. This includes building power lines that are less susceptible to geomagnetically induced currents and creating backup systems for essential services like emergency response and communication networks. 
Public education is another key aspect of preparation. Understanding the risks and knowing how to respond can make a huge difference in minimizing the impact of a solar storm on our daily lives. It's a complex and ongoing process but the ultimate goal is clear, to ensure that we are as ready as we can be for the next big solar storm. While we can't prevent a solar storm we can certainly be prepared. So, should we be losing sleep over the prospect of a solar storm in 2024? That's the question we've been exploring. We've learned about the power of the sun, the potential havoc a solar storm could wreak, and the ways in which we're preparing. A significant solar storm could disrupt our technology, our power grids, and our daily lives. Yet we're not entirely at the mercy of the sun's whims. We have measures in place to help mitigate the damage and research is ongoing to improve our understanding and our defenses. The possibility is there but it's not a certainty. What is certain is that knowledge and preparation are our best defense. So while a solar storm may be a potential threat, it's not one that should keep us up at night. It's a reminder that we're part of a larger solar system with its own rhythms and phenomena. Stay curious, stay aware and remember, the sun may be more than just a source of light and warmth. It's a force of nature that we continue to study and understand. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video. That's all for Nifty Narration.